G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Um, as you can tell, um, and if you've seen the Death Star video, I promised I was going to do a review on the General Grievous pre-cyborg, and uh, so voila, here he is. I'm not really renowned for my um, little figure reviews, but uh, having seen this guy, I thought it was uh, well worth sharing for, for many of us who've never probably seen what the General Grievous looked like pre-cyborg, so I'll turn the back of that box around. So we can have a bit of a clearer look at him. So as you can see here, he's a very tall figure. Actually, compared to uh, the other three and a quarter inch figures, uh, they come to about where my finger is. So he's a, a very imposing and menacing um, warrior, uh, the old Grievous. And uh, as you can see here, he comes with a few weapons. He has like a blaster pistol, rather interesting. Uh, it has it sort of coated in bandages to uh, blend in with the rest of his attire. And then as we spin him around, you can see on the back there, he has also a blade, which can be removed. And uh, there it is there. You'll also notice that our, our Grievous uh, had himself uh, a head of hair back there. And you can see that the uh, hair coming from the, the back underneath his, his helmet. He has his cape here that can be removed. And uh, then he has his sort of garments underneath. But the biggest reveal is General Grievous's helmet because we don't get to see his face in the movie. We just get to see that sort of metal uh, mask that he wears around in his, in his cyborg when he's wielding his lightsabers. So let's have a look and see what General Grievous looked like before he was uh, a cyborg. So you can see there, hopefully the camera's picking that up. We have General Grievous with his head of hair. And we have the rather the pointy ears, so he could be confused for a Vulcan, I suppose, if you're a Star Trek fan. Then we spin him around to the front, and see if I can bring him a little bit closer. Apologies if it's not as, as clear as uh, what you'd like. He has these sort of large teeth, what look like large teeth, protruding from uh, the bottom of his jaw there and the side of his mouth. Has a rather elongated forehead, so obviously he was a very smart man. And, uh, and then have his eyes. So you can see where the Grievous mask comes from because that's the the headgear that he's wearing. And that just slots back over there and goes over the top of his rather pointy ears. And you can see that there, so he's ready for a battle on his home planet. So hopefully you've uh, enjoyed that little insight into uh, General Grievous and the pre-cyborg years. Uh, as I said, if you know more about the history of him, feel free to, to place the comments down. And, uh, and share with the rest of us. It's always um, good to hear people's um, other parts of information that they can share. So thanks for watching. Keep subscribing. Hopefully you've checked out the Death Star review, which uh, you can see there, the Death Star in the background. And um, cheers.